talk about cucumbers. Hi, my name is Kamaya. Welcome to the Harvest of the Month series. In this series, we're learning about locally grown vegetables that you might see in your recipe. Today, we're going to learn about cucumbers together. Guys, did you know that cucumbers are 95% water? That's a lot of water. That means they're super hydrated. Personally, my favorite way to eat cucumbers is just sliced. I like the original taste of cucumbers themselves. Now, let's hear from our friends Alex, Armando, and Yuma on how they grow and use cucumbers. Hi everyone, my name is Alex Booker. I am an assistant farming education manager here at Badger Rock. And we are at our Badger Rock farm, uh, where we are in the Rim Rock neighborhood on the south side of Madison. So here at Badger Rock, we have, uh, we're connected to uh, Charter Middle School and they're building an elementary school right here as well. We grow two different types of cucumbers. Uh, we grow a bush cucumber, where those just grow on their own in a nice little bush and you're able to pick those off of the ground. And we also have the more traditional cucumbers that climb up things that are called trellises. And so those cucumbers will be up on a fence pole or on different vines, and those are the cucumbers that we pick uh, more traditionally. So cucumbers are a type of veggie that we are able to do two different uh, seasons here in our short, short growing season in Wisconsin. And so we're able to start our cucumbers in our greenhouse here at Badger Rock. We start them off and then we let them grow a little bit. And then as soon as we're out of the danger of frost, we put them in the ground uh, and then we're able to get them going. It takes about a month or so before they start bringing out flowers. And then it's just keeping the weeds back and keeping the plants happy. Para el mercado y para que se disfruten de sus deliciosos picolines, que mucha mucha gente le les gustan los picolines. En vinagre. Ajá, mm -hmm. lo, lo pide mucho en el mercado, piden mucho picolín, dice, hey, what is picolín, what is the picolines? Aquí ya van otros, están bebés todavía, yo le calculo si llueve, dos semanas ya están listos para cosechar, como si fueran las calabazas, muy sí, rápido. En, en, de un día para otro. If it, if it rains in one week, they will be ready. Mm -hmm. and... Wow. For, sí. Because they are, you know, for picolin and they grow like, yeah. like zucchini in two hours. A ver, deje buscar uno más grande. Oh, este ya está acá, aire. Este ya está Ooh. más grande, aire. Mm -hmm. Sí. Delicious. Mm -hmm. sí, Super crunchy yeah. and sweet. My name is Yi Mo Yang, and I am the community director for Groundswell Conservancy. We are a land trust uh, based here in Madison, Wisconsin. We own two community farms. One is called Westport Farm, and the other is called Paisley Swan Creek Farm. Um, the Hmong cucumber, I would say this is a staple in the Hmong diet, or at least at least in, um, in Laos and Thailand. Many, many years ago, when the Hmong people immigrated here to US from Laos, um, they brought the seeds with them. And their, their, their minimal lug luggage. Um, and they've been saving and planting those seeds since then um, because we can only grow here um, once a year in the, in the US and specifically the Midwest. It could be uh, used as a cooked vegetables. There's so many different ways to, to just use the monkey cucumber. The, the stories that were shared with me were just were, were really were recently shared with me by elders as a little girl i wish those stories were shared more frequently and more often i think those stories are just so powerful how they got to the u.s and how it's been saved and it's been shared you know with the different generation and then the community with family those stories are the most meaningful because it's it, it's attached to a, a cucumber wow there are so many different types of cucumbers. I cannot wait to try them all. Hmm, I really want to try a new cucumber recipe. What should we try? I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Let's learn how to make homemade pickles. To 
make your quick pickles, you're gonna wanna start with a quick pickle brine. You're gonna combine salt, sugar, and vinegar into a pot and take it to the stove. There, you'll let it boil so that your salt and sugar dissolve. When that's done, combine this vinegar, salt, and sugar with water and let it cool down completely. You can pop it in the fridge. While that's cooling, you're gonna prepare your other ingredients. Here we have cucumbers, dill, garlic, and pickling spices. And we're giving them all a rough chop. Next up, you're gonna put these in your jars. Once it's cooled down, use your brine to fill your jars. Close your jars, refrigerate them for about 30 minutes, and they're ready to enjoy. Thanks for learning about cucumbers with me today. I'm gonna go enjoy the snack. Be sure to check out our other Harvest of the Month videos. We have one on peppers, leafy greens, and corn. See you next time. I'm Gamaya, signing off.